All right, guys, what is happening? Welcome to the channel. Welcome back to Ironclad Motorsport. Today, I'm your host, as always, Simon. Pretend, wannabe race car driver here at Queensland Raceway. This place is fully sick as well after they've done all the renos and out. I've got to say, it's pretty full on. But as always, we've done something different to the car compared to what we normally do, and we're testing it out because this year, like I said, is all about testing out new things before we dial in the car ready for Time Attack next year, which we are planning on winning. Very noisy today, I love it. I got here, I was feeling a little bit sick and that, you know, and then you just hear the, the engines, you get on the camera, you're like, it's just so much more exciting. So, as always, like I said, we've done something different to the car. This time we have a Mishimoto radiator, so an oversized radiator. Took about another three liters of coolant as well, which is really cool. And um, <clears throat> also put on some like spray injection onto the, uh, onto the inner cooler, similar to like the STIs. The WRX STIs have that as well. So look, I don't know if it's gonna work, but um, I've geared it up to when I pull on the windscreen wiper, it's gonna spray um, everything like that. So yeah, I'm gonna show you that now and let's see if it works when we race. guys so that was actually a really fast lap that was 0.7 of a second faster as you can see the time up there in, in the corner of the screen so 62.3 seconds super super happy with that like honestly like the car performed really well i got a really nice line there was heaps of traffic out as you can see but i managed to get in one really really solid lap and i'm thinking if the weather gets a little better, because I'm just going to show you in a sec, the heavens open um, as I came in. But if the weather gets a little better, we'll go out again. And I reckon I can definitely beat that because before the Mishimoto radiator, guys, the temperature was sitting at about 112 degrees. All right. Um, absolutely came the car, got a PB and the temperature went only up to 100 degrees. So it's literally 12 degrees cooler from the Mishimoto radiator. So if you're absolutely pushing the limits of your car, definitely need to fit a, a oversized radiator. Like I said to you at the start of the video, we took about an extra three liters of coolant, but I forgot to show you the um, the actual front of the car where you can see the Mishimoto radiator. So I'm gonna show you that now and you can see the, uh, the little jet sprays on the, on the inner cooler as well. Let's just get out of the car. So you can see in here, Mishimoto radiator, no aircon condenser now either. And then down here we have this, has the little washer jets on it there for the uh, for the inner cooler, little spray. But as you can see fam, the weather has absolutely turned. And you know, literally just open, terrible. My group's going out now. And it's a really busy day as well. The, the guys actually came and said to me, you know, I was kind of mid-pack group three. So there's some really fast guys here today. Um, and they came and said to me, like, hey, can you head out mid-pack um, next round? So, you know, like some of the faster guys don't get held up. Like, Absolutely, um, you know, that's fine. You understand, you know what I mean? Like it's, it's kind of like a time attack run sort of sprint. So yeah, like no worries, but I'm sitting in. <laughs> You know what I mean? I actually might go get something to eat. Um, 
and just chill. But I'll let you guys know if uh, if the weather gets better and I go out again. So fam, you can see like it's literally puddles everywhere. It's just crazy. And it's all coming from that direction as well. And I was like, should I go out? But look at the water on the track. I was like, I need to set a time on the clubman. I was like, should I go out? But right down the end there, I'll try and zoom in. There's an M2 comp in the wall. It was in front of my buddy Lachlan here. It is very wet outside. How wet, bro? I was aquaplaning every single corner. How man. fast do you go in the dry, like kilometers an hour? On the straight here, I would be touching about 160, 165, 170. At the moment, I can't even touch 105. It is yeah. so dangerous. Yeah, wow. Guys, he said to me, is that YouTube worthy? I goes, leave a comment down below, let Lachlan know how he did on his first YouTube appearance here on the channel. But guys, like, nah, I'm just, I'm not bothering, hey. Like, it is absolutely soaking. You can see, like, I'm getting wet. You know, it's look at the clouds behind me. Day done for me, guys. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, hit the like button. Takes no time out of your day, but it really does help the channel. All it does is it means that more people see the video because it gets pushed up the news feed. Um, and then, you know, obviously like more watch time and all that kind of stuff. And it motivates me to do more content for you guys. So thanks so much for watching guys. Subscribe and like.